<sighs> okay, um, hey everyone. So, sorry for, for how long the last video was. I think it was about 15 minutes long. But, I don't know, it seemed very entertaining to me as far as the behind the scenes aspect. It's been a while since I've done a long one like that. Um, so, I am currently trying to reprint that uh, figure that I was trying to make for my friend Andy. Um, hopefully that works. For now, I'm trying to do it separately. Um, I went. I saw Mary Beth, and um, I just got done editing a couple different versions of what we what I shot what we shot that day. Next time I see her, which will be the beginning of next month. She wants to do five videos all in one day of separate different uh, products. Hopefully, I feel like she does, but she might not, I don't know. This kind of stuff gives me anxiety. Um, because if, honestly, if we're going by the same math, she wants five videos, uh, that's like $750, which would be amazing for me especially considering you know driving back and forth and it'll be exhausting but at the same time it won't be because um i'll get all that money um i won't be driving back and forth for multiple shoots i will go there have that exhausting day there and then just smash out you know videos just life has been kind of hard to uh to get together with um doing the mary beth every uh other week or so and then uh working my nine to five job and then um randomly getting music video jobs and, and you know trying to have some substance of a normal life Oh yeah, and also, I mean, I have my own ambitions outside of those projects because, um, you know, doing business videos and music videos is it's cool, um, but my long-term uh, my long-term goal is to make movies like Jurassic Park, Back to the Future. Avengers, Doctor Who, you know, I, that's that's what I want my long-term goal to be, which gives me anxiety a lot. Everything gives me anxiety, <laughs> which I, I'm going to try to see a therapist about that uh, this month. Ah, I don't think I showed you guys that. So yeah, there's my big SD card case, all the big ones and all the uh, micros. I uh, also I sort of successfully made an adapter, but yeah, projector lens is supposed to go in there, and then this end uh, is supposed to go to the other lens. And then this is the uh, first 3D printer I was talking about. This isn't exactly the one, um, because if you watched all my videos, you would remember that it was white. I, uh, I reprinted this. Uh, Honestly, originally for Mary Beth, just, you know, something nice. I've been, like I said, doing lots of presents rather than personal projects because they don't turn out very well. Probably gonna give this one to Elizabeth and then make another one for Mary Beth. This new music video for Ski Bambino sounds like it could be kind of fun because we're actually like putting money into it. Oh, by the way, we are, we are charging 400, like I was talking about at the end of the last video. Um, everything that I predicted is pretty much there. I still don't know how much exactly the paint is, so I haven't sent him an invoice, which I want to already, but technically, technically today I'll figure all that out. Um, because um, Enrique and Jacob supposed to come over to do some paint and set up studio stuff. But I'm also having my niece come over it's gonna be kind of hectic. Um, but the items that we plan on using, do I have the paper? Oh yes, um, is, is 
I don't know if you can see that. Um, it's kind of like a, a swinging light for the, uh, the um, insane asylum. So that'll be interesting. Hopefully we can figure out how to put that together. Um, I got some vintage bulbs from uh, Mary Beth's Capers Emporium. Um, I've always wanted to buy some of these, so pretty cool. Um, in general, that light, if I can do it right, looks nice, so, you know. Yeah, um, and then got a big jug of uh, stage blood to, uh, you know, gruesome it up. Got us a cop uniform. And we are supposed to get a straight jacket, um, but the, the music video shoot is on the 17th, and Amazon says that the straight jacket won't get here until the 20th. Which, that isn't the end of the world, I guess. It's just, I don't know how many of the scenes we want shot with a straight jacket. And, um, you know, just... Jacob is, is leaving his 9 to 5 job to go into a more video editing driven job and I have my hectic schedule and then you know Ski seems like he's only available on the weekends um, it's if, if we don't get everything fil filmed uh, that, yeah this weekend then we probably won't be able to film until next month and I know he wants this, he wants all this done hopefully by December. Um, but also, if we do it next month, I just told you I have those five video projects. Which is, is stressful, but not stressful. But if I have another project like right in there that also needs to be done, I feel like it will add to the stress, you know? Um, but I guess it's good stress. I don't know. Um, Time lapse from the last video was uh, putting up a privacy fence to uh, to get our dog from stop, you know, digging in and running away, which did not work. Um, it looked nice, I guess. I mean, it was practically three thousand dollars to do it. We took out a loan, but that's uh, that's life. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, see you on the flip side.